and welcome back to another video today we have another croissant haul monthly croissant haul i'm sure you've seen by the title i know guys love these ones and um yeah i'm back guys <laughs> i'm back it's really stressful guys you know when you come from grocery shopping and i have to unpack everything just to show you guys and then pack my things refill my fridge refill my pantry and shopping on its own especially with the little one it's really exhausting but i enjoy it sometimes guys i love it i love it so guys we're gonna start with the meat and the things that go in the fridge so that i can pick them away before they thaw so the things you don't see here on today's grocery which which means I still have them in my fridge or pantry. You know the drill, guys. I'm sure if, if you've been in my channel for a very long time, you'd know, for, you know that's what I do on a monthly basis. I'm so tired, guys. I don't want to lie to you. But anyway, it's worth sharing because I know most of you guys love, 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 love my grocery hauls. Anyway, let's get right into video. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you haven't. I buy my meat from Ruth, so I'm gonna start with my meat so that I can quickly put it away in the fridge. So here I've got some beef chuck. You know, this I usually buy it as um, part of the you know steak nights when I just wanna make a steak, maybe with baked potato or salad. You know, just something quick and easy. So I bought six of these ones. And they were going for 106 rand and here i have some ox liver i know this is gonna be like too much this is now for maybe two months or so and it was 149 rand seven 149 rand <laughs> for you know for breakfast or those are uh, brunch meals when you're at home this comes in handy plus hubby loves liver and here we have chicken mala it's a 2 kg i also love these guys you know just we make them nice crunchy crispy and spicy some turkey chops over here as well for 300 rand how many kgs is this um three and a, three and a half kgs of turkey chops potatoes over there i also bought this from rules some beef tripe over here guys will love this especially on weekends definitely weekends we do like the traditional meals whether it's the cow heels or you know the beef tripe so i bought 2 kg of this and it was 99 rand 99 this i'm gonna split into um, i think three portions because i have them oh my god where is my okay i think it's on the other bag okay here i have pors also for 152 rand 30 you know just for breakfast or you know force and mesh quick and easy one and some pork chops over here this is about one and a half kg as well just a few chops there and some cornish Cornish chicken over here. I think I have four, three or four. Yes, here yeah, there's three. I think in another bag there should be another one. This is like a hard body. It's like a hard body chicken. They are so small though. But you know, I was so excited when I got this because I've been craving this for the longest. And I put some spices as well. Chips seasoning for our chips, honey for the team, chicken spice. Mm. And this side guys i have some cow heels this is uh three kgs for the cow heels sands and some beef stew over here for 350 rand this is 4.6 kg i'm gonna clean this up slice it cut it into like uh small cubes and then portion it and some beef dams over there 
just to company the tribe so this i'm gonna clean and push in as well i've shown you this i think that is it from the roots butchery so now we're moving over to the food lovers market groceries so these are the things that i bought let me quickly unpack then we get started so here guys from the food lovers market we have some seafood on crab shell this looks so yummy this is gonna be my first time trying it like this and some i don't even know what this fish is called guys but i love it deep fried and coated in some spicy coating this one so it's a pack and i bought three packs of uh, ground beef over here so they divided which makes uh portioning so easy when you're cooking so they were going for 50 rand this was a huge bargain you guys from food lovers market some mozzarella cheese over here this time around i didn't buy the slices i'm gonna because this was a little bit cheaper so whenever i need i'm gonna be creating some and i have some cheddar over here crushed garlic and must as well sweet corn there's four of these ones we're trying to eat healthy guys <laughs> i don't know how long it will take us but i have four of these ones and these big sausages over here for the lunches and pumpkins four of these ones and some beans over here two packs i'm gonna freeze these guys i'll just push in and freeze them basil over here i don't know what happened to my lid i think when we we're packing in the car seed and extra virgin oil i took two of these ones the food lovers market brand seedless watermelon and must as well some hot sauce i just wanted to try this i don't know the spicy levels of uh, this sauce i hope it's not gonna be like extremely hot so apples there's two bags of apples two boxes of plums mixed peppers some mushrooms we have two button mushrooms there's another one the other side so this came as a combo tomatoes and butternut they were going for 50 rand some bultong this is dry force and some spicy bultong over here box of tomato and here we have these spicy noodles i don't know guys if we want to do the mug the mug bang with me or what i don't know guys what but one thing i know for sure these are very spicy so these were going for 39.99 a pack from food lovers market and i think these were 29 this brand i think it was 29 yes and then the rest were going for 39 rand a pack so this side i have some sweet potatoes i think i've shown you butternut here two packs of beetroot two packs of baby potatoes two packs of um two packs of avon some kimchi i just wanted to try i've never tasted these guys so when i saw this at food lovers market i'm like definitely buying this i just wanted to try it out and three boxes of um some grapes black grapes strawberry juice over there some canola oil i usually buy in case you guys are wondering you, you usually see different types of oils so this is for deep frying anything that needs to be deep fried because i cannot use olive oil deep frying so this one is for deep frying i took two so this is gonna last two months this one and some uh, top up tuna over here mango juice over there some mushroom and here we have this uh, pumpkin it feels so light i hope it tastes so good and i hope it's not rotten because it feels very light and then more of uh these big ones i think that's it from the food lovers market mall so let's move over to the checkers items we have noodles over here deb and curry i think there's three packs and then the chicken flavored ones some doritos over here instant porridge banana and strawberry wheat bakes over here cornflakes we are trying this this is the first time i'm buying this brand so we have to see how it goes and it's a 750 grams some indomie this i buy from uh pick and pay so i bought these ones from pick and pay there's spicy ones 
and then these are uh, just the normal ones some biscuits over there lollipop uh, double smoked sliced into beef chili sauce mozambican chili sauce i love this on my seafood some relaxer kale of milk this is a six pack full cream milk but things soap nola mayonnaise i have two nola mayonnaise vinegar for laundry or anything that needs vinegar i like to buy a five liter it's actually cheaper when i'm getting it as a five liter i usually buy this from roots i don't know where else you can find it from guys maybe this cash and carries i don't know if they do have that but i love this you know for my whites and you know for cleaning my drains as well i use vinegar here we have some croissant wrapping paper over here i want to do a diy gift box for my husband and here we have some adult beverages more yet pong crust crown for crown i have two the other one is the rosé nectar and some water over here as a top up next for the kids for me for school <laughs> the shaving cream for myself baby milk over here i have two tins two big tins cellar tape for my diy project some marshmallows for mia baby wipes from pigs baby food baby food over here and the snakes snake mix over there more drinks over here energy drinks as well some juices for Mia for school lunch boxes. Smoked salmon ribbons. As you all know, guys, I love, I will love this. <laughs> so I'm gonna be using this either for sushi or for hubby's open sandwiches. So that is it, guys, from today's video. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up, comment down below, share, and subscribe if you haven't. Till next time, bye.